Welcome back to the Bush TV. Quick brief on last week's episode. We headed in through La Cola and we headed up to the Barkley River Camp. Great night there. Then we headed off to the Black Soil Track, done the McAllister River Track, headed all the way into Butcher Country Track, where we decided to turn this into a two-part series. So just a quick brief on this one. We've come up from the McAllister River, where we camped on the Cascades at the bottom of Butcher Country Track. We just did Butcher Country Track. Now we're at Howard Hut in the High Plains and we're camping there for the night. So sit back and relax and enjoy the bush TV. This is a nice short and sweet video from the Butcher Country Track to the Howard High Plains and a high elevation camped in Howard Hut. This video was shortened due to a lot of campers coming in down on the McAllister River that forced me to cut the first video into two parts. Butcher Country Track, approximately 31 kilometres in length, starting at the McAllister River Track, connects up to the Howard Road. Also the track connects to the Caledonia River Track. Total altitude, starting at 462 metres at the bottom, heading up to 1600 metres at the top. The track is seasonally closed in the first week of June, and does reopen around the first week in November. The conditions can change, as I have done this trip a few times, and it's been nice down the bottom and snowing at the top. Be prepared, this track can be challenging.
Howard Hut was built by William Bryce in 1899. It marks this hut one of the oldest huts in the high country. The hut was first built with drop slab walls. The hut was rebuilt in the 1920s to 1930s and the roof was converted with corrugated iron in 1938. Howard Hut is closely related to the Wanagatta Station murders and features on the iconic Wanagatta Drive. Ideally I would have camped on the other side of the hut but there's some trail riders over there with some horses in the horse yard. You'll see them later on in the video. So it's time to set up camp and get a fire going. The weather conditions in the Howard High Plains can be very extreme and turn nasty at any time. So you must be prepared set up in this type of condition. For cooking tonight, I'm doing baked potatoes in the camp oven. A very good friend of mine suggested this. I tried them at home and I'm addicted. Stay tuned for the next video and I will do a detailed cook on these. As the night got late, I couldn't detail the actual video on the cook. Sit back and relax and enjoy the five hour time lapse of the stars and the time lapse of the sunset. Absolutely spectacular spot to camp at Howard Hut. Like I said before, you have to be prepared.
Well guys, what a night at Howard Hut. Perfect weather, perfect stars, perfect next day. Stay tuned for the next one. I thank everyone for watching and all your support. If you like what you see, tickle that little thumbs up and that's the best thing you can do for me. If you haven't subscribed, please be a part of the conversation. Hit the subscription and don't forget the bell notification. Thanks for watching The Bush TV.